Let's talk about use of the offhand as a dribbling guard. So you can use your offhand to control the defender so somewhat. Um, if you do it in a particular way, it's really useful for creating space. It's really useful for not losing the ball. It's really useful for just keeping the defender in check and uh, making them give up on reaching for the ball or anything like that. Um, but uh, also it can be an offensive foul. So I'll talk about how it's getting called, when you can use it, and the reason why officials officiate the way they do. So like, um, well, first rule of thumb, the smaller you are, the bigger discrepancy in size between you and your defender, the more you get away with. Little guards on big guards can just do more with their offhand. But the way it pretty much works is if the defender is moving into you, you can use your offhand to create space. If you're moving and the defender is moving and you're close, you can use your arm to create space. Now this is an this is a forearm arm bar, right? That's what you're using. That's what's not going to get called. Those are the situations where it isn't going to get called. Situations where it's going to get called is if there's a stationary defender, you run into them and you use an arm bar, or if you ever throw an elbow. And this is really for safety. You know, officials want it to be a physical game, but they want it to be safe as well. If there's already contact and you're just creating space with an arm bar that's safe. But if you're throwing an arm bar into someone's stationary, that's an offensive foul. It's just dangerous. You throw an elbow, it's dangerous. So uh, this is a good practice because it can train you on uh, controlling the punching bag when it's moving towards you with your offhand and just getting used to uh, controlling the ball uh, uh, and well, while well moving the ball with your offhand. Just really, really good drill. If you don't have a punching bag, that's fine. I don't have access to a punching bag very often, uh, but I found one uh, for this drill, and I figured I would uh, do this work, work on uh, controlling my offhand. It's a, it's a major component to dribbling. I'm just not going to lose the ball, or the defender's not going to take it from me.